in particular, but our destiny is shared. Tonight, we prove once more that the true strength of our nation comes not from the might of our arms or the scale of our wealth, but from the enduring power of our ideals, democracy, liberty, opportunity, and unyielding hope. Three guys. You know, I had to ask them if I should pay for the kid, but they, you know, they said I should. So. They were right too. That's only ten apiece. Correct. The price is fifteen. Dylan charges ten. Recession prices. Who they told me to tell you that too. They made a deal with Mickey for fifteen. Yeah, yeah. But the way they got it, uh, Mickey got in a fight with a whore, the dumb shit, and now they got him in a can, and you're filling in for Dylan, and you get what Dylan gets. No more. You talk to Dylan. Uh, take it up with him. Dylan's dead. Dylan died this morning. Sorry to hear that. Sure, sure they are. It's gonna cost them more. You know, this business is a business of relationships. Yeah, and everyone loved Marky. You are a cynical bastard, you know that? To reclaim the American dream and reaffirm that fundamental truth that out of many, we are one. You hear that line? Line's for you. Don't make me laugh. For one people. It's a myth created by Thomas Jefferson. Oh, now you're gonna have a go at Jefferson, huh? My friend, Jefferson's an American saint because he wrote the words, all men are created equal. Words he clearly didn't believe since he allowed his own children to live in slavery. He was a rich wine snob who was sick of paying taxes to the Brits. So yeah, he wrote some lovely words and aroused the rabble and they went out and died for those words while he sat back and drank his wine and fucked his slave girl. This guy wants to tell me we're living in a community don't make me laugh. I'm living in America, and in America, you're on your own. America's not a country. It's just a business. Now fucking pay me. The best things in life are free, but you can give them to the 